injured hawksbill sea turtle suffered from an entanglement in fishing line. It was pretty severe. It also fractured its humerus bone, which is the bone that connects to the shoulder in animals. So they've saved the flipper. The person holding the flipper is Dr. Maria Chatham. She is the primary veterinarian for medical care and surgical care for the sea turtles at the Gumbo Limbo Center. He was tranquilized with an injection in his muscle, tube into his trachea and control his anesthesia. Mouth gag is taped to their head to keep it stable. And then they put the trach tube in through the middle of the mouth gag and they will tape that in to keep it from dislodging. Completely unconscious at this point and ready for surgery. So the ultimate goal with sea turtle rescue of any kind on the coast of Florida, and in particular with this hawksbill turtle, is to get those animals healthy enough and fully recovered so they can return to their home. Whenever we take a sea turtle in from the ocean, the goal is always to be able to get it back to the ocean where it belongs. Dr. Chatham put a full body cast on this guy so that bone has the best chance of healing. If everything goes perfectly, he's probably looking at at least several months before he can be released.